Yay! Yay. I do something with this car every year. And this year I'm doing my oscillator. Look at the wires, the wires corroded. Shout out to this headlight I got on my head, look at that. The wires pulled out the, out the little connector right there. Connector is right there. Come on camera, stop switching right there. That yellow -ish looking thing right here, my pinky open. That's the uh, connector that came out of. So now I gotta redo the wires. Rebuild the connector. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but I'm trying to figure out how to work the best way to get it out. I don't know if I want to pull it up. If I pull it up, I got to pull all this back. Disconnect this. This uh, radiator mount. Um, radiator support mount, whatever it's called. I'm not a certified mechanic, but you know. I know how to do against the finagle. Like, I did rebuild this car a couple times, but... um. This is the second time this alternator coming out, uh, but you can see why all this corroded, all this uh, cooling and stuff was on top of it. It's causing it to short. The shop wanted eight hundred dollars for this, but I see why they want eight hundred dollars for it. That labor ain't no joke. I'm trying to take the AC compressor out. But, um, the AC compressor. Um, but it's a boat I can get to. Well, I can get to it, but it's kind of, damn, look at this. And I got a light on my head. It's called Delphi, Delphi or something. This dude on YouTube, Life of the Ikes, had put the link in the description. And it wasn't, it was, bruh, this, it was a cheap, good light, too. It's bright. And I can wave it with my hand. It's where I, it's where I like. But. What up, what up? Um. What's up, man? Leak two times. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe so I can quit my job. Um, man, my gate blown. Come on, dog. Come on. I got the alternator out. I'm about to take it for that core. But look, this piece literally disintegrated. Man. Look, look in there. I don't know if I'm showing y'all right. Look in there, bro. Ain't no connector in there or nothing. It just disintegrated. Like, I don't know if you put it in there like that or what. But I'll get another one. Here go my Tahoe. I ain't start that yet. See how we get to this stuff. That's what I just got. I just got some money. My neighbor, my neighbor, she moving. She just retired. Just retired. So she told me when I first when I used to help her out, she was like, um, she was like, uh, when I retire, I'm going back home. I'm like, where you from? She like, I'm from uh. Alabama, so I'm going back down there. She said, I'm gonna have my son give you some money here. I'm gonna have my son do something for you or something. He just pulled out a couple hundred. He just slid me a couple hundred. He said, man, you don't find too many dudes who know, who do stuff like that. I'm like, damn, for real? I just feel like it's right. I don't know, cause I, I plow her yard, I shovel her yard. Cause sometimes I see her, it's hot out here, it's 60 degrees. I shovel her yard and stuff, I see, um. Like sometimes I see her yard covered, her driveway covered. And I just go out there and shovel it because you know she elderly, she older. She's not elderly, but she older. So, you know, I want somebody to shovel my mama yard. I don't know, I just a lot of stuff I just do because I just feel like it's the right thing to do, not because I should do it or or some I'm expecting something to return. Like that really just made me happy because it just paid for my alternator. He just paid, he's like, man, I hope I can buy you lunch or something. I'm like, a couple hundred. You just, I'm like, I'm telling you this. You just paid for my alternator, man. I was just, I just put it in here. 
God bless your soul, man. I just like the right and man. Neighborly. I'm like, yeah. Look at me. I wasn't even expecting her to return for her. I was like, man, you ain't got me no money. I see some singles. I'm like, you ain't got me no money. And I see the hundreds. I'm like, oh, yeah, give me that. Thank <laughs> <laughs> but I'm gonna hate to see her leave, man, because if somebody else moving there, they might be ghetto, rugged, loud, or something. I don't know, man. People, unless somebody, unless the person who's moving there own the house, because people who don't, people who rent, don't give a care, don't, they don't give a care in the world about the house. That's why I hate the, my neighborhood because majority of people renting. If they owned it, they'd probably take better care of it. If they knew. You know, if they knew about the the principles and the stuff of uh, the the benefits and the stuff of owning a house, like you would take take better care of it. It's right there. You just look at that man. Look at God, man. Thank you, God, for waking me up, getting me out the house. Okay, let me get my family situated first. Let me get my foundation first. Let me get my you know family stuff first, and then I. Uh, worry about bringing other kids along so that's what I've been working on lately I ain't worried about other kids yet sorry y'all if y'all watching this sorry y'all that's why I ain't been letting y'all come over that's why anybody been at my house I'm trying to get my family right if when you you when you older you'll probably understand if you don't understand you gonna understand I cut all of this with my with that one thing last year look at it growing back beautiful I should have kept that job. Yeah, I quit my job. Yeah, it was a big mistake. I should never quit. But things happen. I'm glad, but I'm glad, I'm glad it happened because G-Wagon. I'm glad it happened because if it didn't happen, I probably wouldn't be on this path I'm on right now. I probably wouldn't, you know, start going to, you know, start reading the Bible. I probably wouldn't, you know, Read books. I probably, I probably just say I'm, I'm gonna do this. I want to do this and not actually doing it. But I got help. I got therapy. Look at me looking rough. I just need a haircut. I got help. I got therapy. I got you know. Um, um, you know, I got another job. I'm making more than I was making when I quit. Um, yeah. He really just blessed me though. If I see him again, I'm like, bro, you really don't know how blessed you just, how you, how you just blessed me though. Know? Like, cause I ain't had this money from the offset. My girl was buying this offset. I ain't got no job. Why? I quit the last one. I quit the last one before that. I quit, I keep quitting them. I ain't quitting this one. I'm working my way up in this one. Cause I feel like when I had a job, I wasn't working for nothing. I was just working. I was just going there. So when you ain't, when you just going to work and not working towards something in that company, it just makes work boring. Or you're not working towards for something in life. It's just boring, but I mean, I was working towards for something, but I'm gonna be honest. I was in debt, so much debt that I wasn't able to live freely. I wasn't able to live. I wasn't able to escape that debt. I couldn't take nothing out of retirement. I couldn't take nothing out of deferred comp. I couldn't take no money. Um, they wouldn't let me take no money out unless it was an emergency, a medical emergency. I'm like, but I'm broke. I'm starving. You know, my, you know I'm behind on my bills, but that was my fault. Um, this is how you when you when you work on cars in a budget, you put a bag on, especially when you work on under a car. And it'd be like stuff leaking, like cooling, oil, whatever. Put a bag on. It's gonna be cheap, like me. Yeah. I probably put the holes in the room. I probably didn't get the holes better. My back was wet yesterday, so learned my lesson. I laid some stuff down, but still. Shoot. Yeah. Dog throw this up. Hey. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Hey. Hey. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna go back to working. The alternator is in. Look at that clean. Ooh, shiny. I gotta put the AC compressor back in. That ain't nothing though. The AC compressor was cool for real. It was the alternator. That's the problem. 
And I ain't never do them in the crowd before. Somebody else did it. First time. When the crowd went in my position, my, my brother had it. Somebody else did it. So I wish I did it the first time, though. Nissan lives once again. <gasps> That's my helper. He ain't did nothing, but. You can stay right there. Hmm. Get over here. He's denying all the cars. Nah, 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 nah. Thirsty butt. Mamba tripping, tasting squirrels. Malik tripping. But anyway, the boy is done. I ain't really hooked that. I ain't really hooked the AC all the way back up because it was never hooked up in the first place. Because the dude lost a screw and he broke another um another stud part to the you know the AC the AC lines. So hopefully. Shit, ain't no hopefully. I don't give a fuck. Fuck. Oh well. Um I ain't use the AC anyway. The AC delete. <laughs> so ain't no AC. <laughs> ain't no AC in here. I ain't had no AC last year. I don't think I had AC the year before that. I mean the alternator is in. The AC is in. The belt's back on. I'm gonna leave it like this. Come through. I'm gonna do an oil change. I got some oil in. I just need an oil filter. The baby should be here soon. The doctor called earlier. Like, yeah, we're gonna induce labor on the 28th. Damn, man, I can start work next week. I start work on Monday. It's Friday. But anyway, I'm gonna tell my job like, the baby coming. What you want me to do? The baby coming. I'm expecting the baby coming. So, but the only thing is, I ain't trying to be in labor for a long ass time. I don't really like hospitals. I don't want to be in the hospital for a long time. Man, we in the hospital three days with him. I don't want to be in the hospital no more than two days. Yeah, I'm about to get these groceries. And that's it for this video, man. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, so I can quit my job. <laughs> and, um, yeah, man, please, motivate me. When y'all hit that like button, <coughs> excuse me. When y'all hit that like button, and I see them views going up, and subscribers going up, like, I don't even promote my channel, but I see subscribers going up, I be happy as hell, I'll be like, yes. It motivates me to come back out here. Maybe it motivates any other YouTuber to do to want to do more. Make sure I like, comment, subscribe. The Tahoe gonna come along. The Cutlass. Man, we don't know what we gonna do with the Cutlass for real. The Nissan done. The Camaro. Hi. Hi. The Cutlass got a rod knot. I'ma temporarily fix that. I'm gonna, that's what I'm gonna do a video on that. Temporarily fixing a rod knot. Um. So yeah, I already took the oil. Already changed the. Already did the oil pan gasket one time. The oil pan gasket was leaking. Do the ride knock and the power steering gearbox line. The, the Nissan, I'm gonna wrap it. It's gonna get wrapped yellow and black. The truck, it's gonna be black. And um, look like blue decals. Um, I might get it wrapped though. So I gotta pick, pick the paint. Paint costs more to wrap, I think. I think. One day, baby, and then it's gone. The next day, it's gone. This game. One day, baby, and then it's gone. The next day, it's gone. This is what I need. Say I'm getting off work, and say I'm getting off work, right? And all the restaurants be closed. Like, dude, what's going on? That's how I wish I lived next to a, next to a, like a, a sheets or something. The next day. Oh, this fool lasted a long time, mama. It's me. Let me go check this fire. I finally picked up all the leaves, y'all. My yard about to come back now. I might get true green again. Get them up in my yard, okay? That perfect. That's all I need to burn. Rest of that to burn. It's a little chilly. I should plug it up, huh? Damn, what wires go where? That's the only thing I don't know. What wires go where? I'm gonna ship some electrical grease. 
I think the brown wire went in the middle. Does it matter? I'm pretty sure it matters. Should I just do it tomorrow? Anyway, there's another Nissan fix and everything. That's, that's all you know. That's all you need to know. The piece came, the Nissan fix. Two times.